Yesterday, I made a Rasul clay mix with the addition of two herbs said to strengthen the hair. I used a small amount of fenugreek seed and a few dried hibiscus flowers to make a simple tea. Now I didn't want to use any oils for this mix because I wanted to test how my hair would respond to Russell Clay with a simple tea. This Russell Clay is from MountainRoseHerbs.com, which actually sells real Russell Clay. Now, okay, okay, okay. Now, this is not a tutorial video, all right? This is a recipe video. So don't think for a minute that you're gonna see my muddy head all up in this video, okay? Now, I personally don't like my clay mixes to be in a paste form. I like them to be more liquid than solid because it spreads better throughout my hair. Now, you can choose to stop here and use the Russell mix after adding 1 4th cup of hibiscus and fenugreek tea. If you like paste, if this is what you like, you don't have to continue and add the other 1 4th cup. After adding the full one half cup of tea, my mix is smooth and more like a liquid than a paste. It makes it easier to put into a squeeze bottle to cut down on the mess as well. Now the Russell Clay Naturals often brag about is the pinkish gray version which absorbs liquid very well and feels smooth on the hair. Not, 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 not the reddish orange version often called Moroccan Red Clay. That's not the one. I've used them both. No. The two are not the same and they certainly don't feel the same on your hair. Anyway, thanks for watching this video and make sure to click over to CurlyT.com to get more complex DIY recipes. Thanks for watching and I'll talk to you guys soon.